Mike Tyson recently stirred up a storm by teasing Canelo Alvarez in front of a global audience, creating a situation that might be hard to recover from. We're delving deeper into the ongoing drama, rumors, and intense moments in the boxing world involving Canelo Alvarez, David Benavidez, and the unpredictable twists that keep unfolding. Benavidez yeah. could beat everybody. Does he beat Canelo, in your opinion? I think he beats everybody he gets in the ring with. So I don't have to say nobody's name or anything. Picture this. The legendary Iron Mike Tyson stands at ringside, observing as David Benavidez faces off against Demetrius Andrade. The atmosphere is electric with anticipation. But here's the surprise. Tyson initially aimed for a Benavidez versus David Morrell match, focusing on the Cuban firepower. Hold on to your seats because there's been a complete turnaround. Iron Mike is now fully backing the idea of a Canelo versus Benavidez showdown. In a recent interview, Tyson made a bombshell revelation, stating that indeed it's a must-have. It's something he's been requesting. The shift in perspective is as monumental as a decisive knockout blow. Iron Mike, the revered voice in the world of boxing, is now fervently rallying behind the Canelo versus Benavidez clash. Who wouldn't desire a prime spot to witness these two colossal fighters collide in the ring? But let's backtrack a bit. Initially, Tyson was hyped about a showdown between Morel and Benavidez. He was eager to see Benavidez face off against the Cuban powerhouse, expressing, I want to see Benavidez fight David Morel, the Cuban guy. He packs a serious punch. It seemed like the entire boxing community was gearing up for the Morel matchup. However, Benavidez, with his burning ambition, had different plans, particularly after his spectacular victory against Andrade. Now, here's where the plot thickens more than a protein shake. Benavidez wasn't solely focused on Canelo. He also had his sights set on Morel. This unexpected twist added even more drama to the unfolding storyline. He made a startling announcement stating that if the highly anticipated Canelo fight doesn't materialize, he's ready to step into the ring against David Morel. This declaration left the boxing world divided between Canelo and Morel, heightening the already sky-high anticipation. Just when it seemed like the intensity couldn't escalate further, whispers started circulating in the boxing arena about a potential May showdown between Canelo and Jamie Munguia. Can you imagine? That's a surprising twist. However, Benavidez, showcasing his strategic prowess, isn't stepping back. No, he's got a comprehensive plan to corner Canelo into a fight. In a recent interview with ProBox TV, the Mexican fighter revealed his strategy. Brace yourselves, fight fans. If Canelo decides to lock horns with Mungia in May, Benavidez has his eyes set on Germal Charlo, the fighter who's been eager to face him. Benavidez considers Charlo a potential dance partner for Canelo, and by defeating Charlo, he's aiming to pave his way straight into a showdown with the red-headed Mexican maestro. Now let's redirect our attention to Benavidez's young son, who is creating a stir in the boxing world. Picture this heartwarming scene. A video emerges online showcasing Benavidez's two-year-old son displaying lightning-fast punches. I'm not exaggerating, folks. It's akin to witnessing a potential future boxing prodigy in action. The internet exploded with excitement when this clip of Benavidez's son surfaced. The caption on Instagram, Benavidez 300 son, like father, like son, sparked a wave of admiration. Social media users were amazed. Some likened the child's moves to his father's, stating it was akin to watching a pint-sized version of the Mexican fighter in action. The boxing world was abuzz with the prospect of a new generation of fighters stepping into the ring. Someone even suggested that the kid might be quicker than Canelo himself. Yes, you heard it right. He's apparently faster than Canelo and maybe even hits harder too, according to one bold user's declaration. Now that's a statement bound to spark controversy. But let's refocus on the main attraction, the highly anticipated Canelo versus Benavidez showdown that's on everyone's mind. Benavidez is strategically maneuvering his way towards securing that sought-after fight. Whether it's against Charlo, Canelo, or any other challenger stepping into the ring, Benavidez is primed and prepared for battle. Here's another twist in the tale. Rumors circulating in the boxing world suggest Canelo might square off against Jamie Mungia in May next year, potentially creating an obstacle for Benavidez. However, he remains undeterred. The Mexican fighter has a well-thought-out plan and is prepared to execute it. In an interview with ProBox TV, Benavidez outlined his strategy. 
If Canelo decides to engage with Munguia, Benavidez has his sights set on Jermal Charlo as his next prospective opponent. It's akin to a strategic chess match in the world of boxing, and Benavidez is deftly moving his pieces with precision. Let's refocus on the Canelo versus Benavidez storyline. While the boxing world eagerly anticipated this monumental clash, the spotlight momentarily shifted to Benavidez's son. Yes, the little tyke who's already displaying punches with the speed of a seasoned professional. Then came the audacious claim that Benavidez's son might outpace Canelo himself. He's already faster than Canelo and probably hits harder too, boldly declared one user. It's the kind of banter that spices up boxing discussions. Now let's add another twist to the narrative. What if Benavidez's son and Canelo's son truly face off in the future? Imagine a battle between the boxing heirs, a showdown transcending generations. The excitement surrounding such a matchup would be unparalleled, elevating the legacy of these fighters to mythical proportions. But hold on, there's more. Rumors are swirling in the boxing circles about a potential face-off between Canelo and Jaime Munguia. Just picture the explosive showdown, two Mexican powerhouses colliding in the ring, each possessing their unique set of skills and strategies. It's the kind of clash that holds the potential to redefine the landscape of boxing. While the boxing world speculates about Canelo's next move, Benavidez is playing the long game. He's strategically positioning himself for the ultimate checkmate on the chessboard of the sport, whether it's against Mungia, Charlo, or the elusive Canelo. Benavidez is poised to seize his moment in the spotlight. Let's delve into the psychological game at play here. Every move and every statement made by these fighters adds another layer of intrigue to the unfolding drama. When Mike Tyson shifted his preference from initially favoring a Morel versus Benavidez matchup, it sent shockwaves through the boxing community. It signaled a shift in the winds, indicating that the anticipated Canelo versus Benavidez showdown was gaining momentum. Speaking of mind games, Benavidez's consideration of Morel as a potential opponent was a strategic maneuver. It wasn't solely about an immediate clash, but rather about conveying a message. He communicated, I'm not afraid to take on anyone in this division. I'm willing to confront the most challenging opponents to showcase my capabilities. The boxing world admires a fighter with such a fearless mentality, someone who embraces tough challenges without hesitation. Now, turning back to the prospect of Canelo facing off against Mungia, if that matchup materializes, it introduces another intriguing element onto the chessboard. Mungia, with his unique skills and achievements, poses a significant challenge. It's the kind of bout that could further solidify Canelo's legacy or serve as the platform for a new rising star to emerge. However, Benavides is an idol. He's actively strategizing and meticulously planning his moves. Bringing up Yermal Charlo as a potential opponent in case Canelo chooses to fight Mungia is a brilliant tactical move. It's akin to playing a three-dimensional chess game, anticipating the actions of both potential opponents and positioning himself for the most favorable outcome. In the world of boxing, it's not just about physical abilities, it's also about the mental game, the capacity to outmaneuver your adversary and execute strategic moves that lead to victory. Every statement and decision made by these fighters is a calculated move on this intricate chessboard, and the stakes are nothing short of legendary. Social media erupted with users sharing their thoughts on the young Mexican prodigy, drawing comparisons to his father. The rumors swirling around a potential future matchup involving Canelo's son, and the bold assertion that the youngster might even surpass Canelo's speed, only fueled the already intense anticipation. And let's not underestimate the impact of nicknames in the boxing realm. One user amusingly proposed a moniker for Benavidez's son, the Baby Monster. It's the kind of catchy nickname that could catch on and become a brand of its own. Who knows? Perhaps we'll see the baby monster making headlines in the future. Now, considering the potential face-off between Benavidez's son and Canelo's offspring, the idea of a new generation carrying forward the legacies of their fathers strikes a chord with boxing enthusiasts. It represents the continuation of a story spanning decades, infusing an emotional layer into the sport. But here's a thought for you, fight fans. What if the narrative takes an unexpected turn? What if, instead of a future clash between the offspring, we witness a collaboration? Picture this, a training session fostering a mentor-mentee relationship that transcends rivalry. It's the sort of unexpected twist in the narrative that could potentially inspire a new era of camaraderie in the boxing world. Now let's refocus on the main event, the Canelo versus Benavidez showdown. 
The strategic maneuvers, the mind games, the possibilities of different matchups, it's a storyline that has captured the imagination of every boxing enthusiast. Whether you align with Team Canelo, Team Benavidez, or just revel in the drama, one thing is certain, the boxing world is in for a spectacle. As rumors circulate and narratives evolve, anticipation for the eventual clash between these two titans continues to escalate. Will it be Canelo, the established legend, or Benavidez, the hungry contender, who emerges victorious? That's the resounding question reverberating through the boxing halls, and the answer eagerly awaits inside the ring. And let's not overlook the potential curveballs that the boxing gods might toss our way. What if Canelo's anticipated matchup with Munguia takes an unforeseen turn, creating fresh opportunities for Benavidez? What if Charlo unexpectedly enters the scene, leading to a surprising three-way clash of champions? Here we find ourselves amidst a whirlwind of rumors and speculations. The talk of the town revolves around Canelo versus Benavidez, and we're simply along for this exhilarating ride. Iron Mike altered the narrative, Benavidez's son stole the spotlight, and the strategic chess game among fighters is escalating. Now with this calculated backup plan in motion, what unforeseen twists and turns await us in the next chapter of this gripping boxing saga? One thing's certain, the ring is heating up and we're all front row spectators to this thrilling drama. So that's all from today's video. If you enjoyed it, remember to leave a like, subscribe and ring that bell icon so you never miss our upcoming videos. And don't forget to share your thoughts in the comments section. Stay tuned and we will catch you in the next video.